Are 1 and 1 relatively prime? That is, is 1 relatively prime to itself? That's what we'll be going over in today's quick Wrath of Math lesson. This is a viewer requested video. I always appreciate those viewer requests, so be sure to leave yours down in the comments. Now let me quickly recap you on the definition of what it means for two integers to be relatively prime. Then I think you'll start to get an idea of the answer to the question. We say that two integers are relatively prime if their only common positive divisor is 1. Now recall that 1 is a divisor of every integer. So every pair of integers do have a divisor of 1 in common. If 1 is the only positive divisor they have in common, that's what makes them relatively prime. So start to think on our question, is 1 relatively prime to itself? Another way we could state the definition of relatively prime is like this. Two integers, a and b, are relatively prime, or mutually prime, or co-prime, if their greatest common divisor, so the GCD of a and b, is equal to 1. Certainly, if 1 is the only positive divisor of two numbers, then 1 is their greatest common divisor divisor. So that's just another way that we can state the definition of relatively prime. So is, is this true about 1 and 1? Is the greatest common divisor of 1 and 1 equal to 1? Well, we can actually push that a step further. Instead of just answering that question, what is the greatest common divisor of 1 and literally any integer? Well, 1 is a divisor of any integer. 1 divides every single integer, and 1 is the only positive divisor of itself, so necessarily the greatest common divisor between 1 and any integer has to be 1. So in fact, 1 by definition is relatively prime to every integer, which includes itself. So just for an example, what's the greatest common divisor of 1 and 12? Well, 1 is a divisor of both 1 and 12, and 1 is the greatest divisor of 1, so it is the greatest common divisor of 1 and 12. And so 1 and 12 are relatively prime. And then directly addressing our question, what's the GCD of 1 and 1? Well, clearly it's 1. That's the only positive number that divides 1. So it's the greatest common divisor of 1 and 1, and so 1 and 1 are by definition relatively prime. That's the answer to the question. 1 is relatively prime to every integer. There's actually another integer that has the same property. What integer do you think it is? Of course, it's negative 1. We can write negative 1 as 1 times negative 1. So positive 1 clearly divides negative 1. And in fact, positive 1 is the only positive divisor of negative 1. So it has the same property as 1 that 1 is its only positive divisor. So for the same reason, negative 1 will be relatively prime to every integer because again, 1 is the only positive divisor of negative 1. 1 is a divisor of every integer, so the greatest common divisor of negative 1 and every integer will be equal to 1, just like it is for positive 1. So we could make this a negative 1, this statement would still be true. So both 1 and negative 1 are relatively prime to every integer, including themselves. 1 and negative 1 are relatively prime, 1 and 1 are relatively prime, negative 1 and negative 1 are relatively prime as well. So I hope this helps answer the question. Let me know in the comments if you have any other questions, need anything clarified, or have got any other video requests. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time, and be sure to subscribe for the swankiest math lessons on the internet.